Well, hello there, and welcome to Splatoon. No, I'm just kidding. No, welcome to Freddy Fish 4, the case of the hogfish rustlers of Brainy Gloch. Gloch. Yep. Yep, not even gonna try. Welcome to Freddy Fish. Let's get started. Let's do this. Ma'am? Howdy. Are we there yet, Freddy? Almost. Sure is nice of your cousin Calico to teach us all about raising hogfish. She'll be glad for the help. It's hard to run a big ranch all by yourself. Will we get to wear ten gallon hats? I think a five gallon hat is more your size. Come on, let's go. I'm at least seven gallons, Freddy. Six and a half minimum. Oh, yeah. Did you hear that? Freddy Fish. Mm hmm. You're, you're not gonna say anything? Let's hurry. Calico's expecting. Yeah, Calico's waiting. A cat. A Calico the cat. Yeah. There's Cousin Calico's ranch. I'm raring to go. She looks like she's a little uh, iffy right now. She's like, oh god. Oh my god. Where's my dog? Hi, Cousin Calico. Oh, hello, Freddy. Howdy, Luther. We're ready to help out. Which way to the hogfish? Well, it seems we got a little problem there. See, my prize winning hogfish herd is being rustled. Rustled? What does that mean? Somebody came and took them without asking. That's not right. No, it's not. And a hogfish requires proper care. I think they might be in real trouble. I just don't know what to do. Did you call the police? I think the sheriff's gone out of town. And I need to stay here at the ranch in case the hogfish get away and come home. Not to mention all the worrying I have to do. We'll help you, Cousin Calico. Luther and I will find the hogfish and catch those rustlers. Yeah! Thank you both. You'll be doing me a real good turn. My god, I, it took, I think, about two hours to get this all together. My, the suffering thing even screwed up too, so I was like, fix this, fix that, we're good. Oh yeah, you so elaborate. Can we go in your house? No? Okay. Maybe I want to see what you had. Did you have some jigs? Ooh! Look, Freddy! A purple sea urchin! Oh god, I don't want to collect anything. We're rich! Are we? Are we? We aren't rich. See that? You're rich. Put that back. Okay, let's go. Oh my goodness. Here we are in Briny Gulch. This must be the town square. Let's go ask some of the people who live here if they know anything about those rustlers. Um. Uh, some of these games Customers. are like. <clears throat> Hello and welcome to Just Buckles. I'm Nelson Toso. How can I help you today? I'm Freddy and this is Luther. And we're helping my cousin, Calico Catfish. Rustlers took all of her hogfish. <gasps> Rustlers? Well, I wouldn't know anything about that. Oh. If you don't tell me. See that little baby? Yeah. I'll do something to it. I will poke it with that. See that? I don't think I need that. Yeah, I just did. Does he not want to talk to me? Do you work out a lot? Why? Um, no. Making buckles is hard work. So I don't really need to work out. <laughs> 
Okay, you were shown off. Let's go. I don't want to talk to you. What's this? Did you see this picture? It's my son. Ooh. Oh, Nelson. He was real cute as a baby. Don't you think? He has your forearms. I'm going to kidnap it. I oh, mean, kidnap it. I'm going to kidnap it. Where is it? I will find it. I'll find it. Okay, let's go talk to these people. Well, they are drunker than drunk. Hey. Hi, I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my best friend, Luther. Orca Squid, of the Santa Clara Squids, and these would be Perry and Ace. Hi, Perry. <gasps> er, uh, Apricot. Hi, uh, Ape. Some rustlers took my cousin's hogfish. Have you seen or heard anything suspicious? Rustlers taking your cousin's hogfish sounds mighty suspicious to me already. Yes, it does, actually. I mean, what are you feeding them out there? Or what are you giving them? Talk to me. Howdy, youngsters. I'm Saltwater Stella, owner and operator of the Soda Loo. What can I do for you? We wanted to ask you if you've seen any rustlers around here lately. Rustlers? Well, there were a couple of suspicious characters in here yesterday. They might have been rustlers. They sat at that table right over there. What is under that table? Oh, boy! Maybe they left a clue. Thank you. This one right here? Let me look at that. Look, Freddy. Maybe this is a clue. Meet at the Rusty Rustler at high tide. Memorize the combination and then eat this note. Two, one, three. I'll bet the Rustlers left this. I wonder why they didn't eat the note like it says. Well, they were it happy. probably tastes like paper. We'll hang on to it. That combination must be important. Well, they're halfway eating it. It's like, look at that little chunk right there. What's he doing? Hi, I'm Freddy, and this is my pal Luther. Well, hello. Hey, Finkert Phil. Doctor of Piano Ology, at your service. Stella at the counter said she saw some suspicious looking types in here yesterday. She's not even there. Did you see anything? We think they might have been rustlers. Rustlers? No, I wouldn't know a thing about that. I know the piano, and it knows me, but that's about it. Sorry. I can't help you out. That's okay. Thanks anyway. Are you sure? I'll kidnap your son too. I'll, I'll do it. I will take everyone's son. I knew it! Yeah. Hi, it's me. Listen, I want to talk to you about that note. We got it. Got it. I ain't kidnapping your son now. Let's go. Before he comes after us. Um, this way? Oh, <gasps> two, one, three. Come on. Let's check out that hatch. Okay. Go, 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 go. Ooh. This shouldn't be too hard. We just have to punch in the combination. Yeah, just nine. Get to it. Oh, Jesus. Zero. God. One. Two. One. Is it two one zero? <laughs> it won't open. It's locked. Maybe we can find out the combination. Wait a minute. Didn't I see a combination written somewhere? Hmm. Am I losing my mind? Meet at the Rusty Rustler at high tide. Memorize the combination and then eat this note. Two, one, three. Two, one, three. Not two, one, zero. Maybe we can get it open. Shh, 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 shh. One, two, three. <laughs> She did it! It's open! Obviously it is, I Boy, guess. Boy, I'll say! 
Eat it. I guess it. the Eat lock it. was the only thing holding the door on. Tom Sarnett, what's that racket? I'll eat paper if you eat paper. Someone's coming! Hurry! Aw, oh, fiddlesticks! The door came off again. Well, I guess I'll just have to sit here and stand guard. I wonder if they still called it standing guard if you're sitting down. the combination anymore. Oh my god, he ate paper. I should eat paper too. Well? Right. I can see no. why the wrestlers didn't eat it. It tasted like paper. Ah, I, I don't even want to know. Yeah, let me go eat some paper. Uh, no, I, I'm not eating that. Is there anything up here? That's the end of the road. Up here. Road closed due to construction. Back short. Road closed due to construction. Back short. What the hell am I supposed to do? Oh, oh. No, I need that. Keep here. Go see Calico. Maybe she'll want something. Hey. Cousin Calico, we saw one of the rustlers. You did? They're at the old ship, the Rusty Rustler. That's good work, both of you. Any sign of the hogfish? They're probably in there too, but we'll have to get inside to find out. Let's go. Ooh, ooh. Oh no, that's to that. Okay. <laughs> I was like, why is it pointing that way? Like, right there. Yeah. Okay, what does he want? Hey. It's wrestlers only in the hideout. Oops, I didn't think I was supposed to say it was a hideout. We might be wrestlers. How do you know we're not wrestlers? That's easy. You're not dressed like wrestlers. If you were a wrestler, you'd have a 10-gallon hat like mine, a belt buckle like mine, and a fashionable bow tie. Totally all wrestlers dress exactly alike? Yep, we all wear the latest wrestler gear. You can see from this picture in WrestleMania magazine. Hmm, an orange 10-gallon hat a big old belt buckle with a K on it, and a bow tie. Since you're not wearing these things, you must not be rustlers, so you can't come in. Cause this hideout is for rustlers only. Okay, thank you. This is the rustler hideout, all right. I'm sure the hogfish are inside. What are we going to do? We've got to get some new clothes. Oh my god, you, you right there. I, why, why would you even give me that? Ooh, pigs. All right, you hogfish, quiet down or else, or else I'm calling Mr. Big. <laughs> Can I have a Do you hear something? It was no. probably just the current. I guess. Can we can, can we go this way now? Ooh, ooh. I yes. guess whoever was working here is done now. That was super fast of you. It's cool. Looks like Big Pal's a crap right there. That's a nice that? screwdriver you have there. Thanks. Do you think we could borrow it for a while? No, we might need it to work on this dance floor. Maybe later when it's finished. Why is it laying? 
in the middle of like the road area. Make more sense. Hi, cutie. What's up? My name's Freddy Fish, and this is my best pal, Lister. Howdy, kids. Folks call Sounds me like Sahara strength. Slim, professional traveling man and blues musician. Musician? Do you play an instrument? Harmonica. Obviously, we need that. Can we have that? Where's your harmonica, Slim? We'd like to hear you play. Well, I got a little song about that. Listen here. Oh, I used to play harmonica all the live long day. But now I miss my Monica. I traded it away. Yes, I traded my harmonica. The apple of my. I traded away my Monica for a ratty old bow tie. You traded your harmonica for a bow tie? Yeah, I wish I hadn't. Now. So I just said he traded it for. That was awful. Sing better. What is this? Free wood. That is fantastic. Oh boy! I see another purple sea urchin! Why are you out of water? Why, why are you... Gee, there's a porthole. Let's try to get over there. That wasn't even trying. We can't get in there. So what? Through here. Okay, we are obviously missing something. Let's go. Obviously. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip that. Let's go that way. Hey. Hello? Are you the mailman? Oh my no, god. No, I'm Freddy Fish. Go away. I'm waiting for an important package. <laughs> oh no. It's missing a handle on the lid. That's why the lid won't shut. You could be so much nicer. That was... Oh god, not this part! Can I... Hey Luther, what's round and purple and pokey? It, is it on me? No, silly. It's a purple sea urchin over there! Oh! It's just a pile of junk. It's a boat. Oh god, yep, knew it. Yikes! A purple shark. With he a... must be really hungry. I need to diet. Maybe if we give him something to eat, we can swim past him while he's busy. Good idea. <laughs> was enough time for us to swim past. No, I don't think so. That was so much time. Oh my goodness. It must be so nice being it's in It's addressed to E. Tippett. Hi, I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my best buddy, Luther. Hello, Freddy. I'm you. That's silly. You're not Freddy. No, you like the letter U. Just you? Is it short for something? Yes, it's short for Uriah, Jedediah, Euripides, Algernon, Fortescue, Forsyth, um, um, No, now what was the rest of it? Um, we'll just call you you. Most folks do. 
Um, can we can we deliver that? We could deliver your package for you if you like. Oh no, that's against the rules. I have to deliver it myself. It looks like the wheel on this wagon has fallen off. Maybe we can fix it. No, oh, gra grab the ladder. Grab the ladder. <sighs> The wheel looks like it just needs a new nut to hold it onto the wagon. Putt putt. Obviously a square. Hey you! That's your wagon over there, right? Yep. It broke down, so I'm delivering the mail on foot. Takes a little longer that way, though. How long has it been since your wagon broke down? Little over two years. It looks like you've gone about five feet since then. Yep. Making pretty good time. Pretty good time. Hmm. Are you ready to start? What the hell is this? Here's a fun game. Pop the bubbles before they run into you. This is boring. This is boring. How'd I leave? Quit. <sighs> oh, he picked it up. Oh, he went back. Okay. Um. Now what do we do? Oh, he's he's pissed, obviously. No, I I didn't want to click that. Okay. Okay. It has something to do with this. You two look like you've got trouble. <laughs> you could say that again. We made this floor for the big square dance tomorrow. Only we found out it has to be, well, square. And we are out of wood. We need some more to start over. A piece about six feet by six feet ought to do it. Six by six? Alright, uh, let's do this. Six by six. Let's go to Lowe's. This one, obviously. This should be useful. How did you do that? That's my special secret. Holy shit. We obviously know where she put it at. I don't even want to say it. That's, that's um... Cooler. Here, can you use this piece of wood for Nobody your Nobody wants that. Say, that looks about right. Perfect. Thanks a lot. We owe you one. You're welcome. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Coffee break? Exactly. Why, why are you winking at him? He obviously can't see you winking at him. Now that your floor is finished, do you think we can borrow your screwdriver for a while? Sure. In fact, you can keep it. Consider it payment for a job well done. Gee, thanks. She will occur, thanks. Let's go, please. I think I s that was torture. Give me a hand. Ooh. Good evening, ma'am. Sir, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Gil Barker, and I represent the Biloxi Premium Gum and Wheel Nut Company, third largest distributor of bubble gum and wheel nuts in the Upper Western Hemisphere. I'm Freddie Fish, and this is my pal Luther. 
My employers have authorized me to clear out my inventory to make room for next year's models. Everything must go. Therefore, I, Gil Barker, will be offering you prices so outrageously low that you'll have to bend over to see them. Great. We'd like to buy one of your wheel nuts, please. Certainly. Now, the nuts cost three purple sea urchins, so I'll start you on one of our nut layaway plans. And you can have your nut when you've paid me the other two purple sea urchins. And may I say that a fickle bit wheel nut is really an excellent investment. Yes. Yeah. There are so many bad Here's jokes in here. Here's a purple sea for you. Thank you very much, young lady. Which of my two fine products are you interested in today? The delicious bubblegum or the very useful wheel nuts? Here's okay, okay, let's just skip this. I can't. You can select any shape you like. That's this square. one looks good. Thank you. No, thank you. Let's buy another wheel nut. I don't think we need one. Friendly reminder to Gil Barker. You owe Shady Shark 20 clams. Pay up pronto. What's this? Oh, that's, uh, that's nothing. It's a poem I was writing. Oh, beautiful. That's an awfully strange poem. Yeah. I have my own you. Alright, let's go find a... Good Ooh. evening, sir. May I interest you in... You got the 20 clams you owe me, Gil? You got the 20 clams? Uh, not exactly. How much is not exactly? I've got a few purple sea urchins. You know, my dogfish needs an operation. Don't worry. I've got a really big deal uh, about to go down. Yeah? What is it? All I can say is, it's really big. I'll have your clams in a couple of days. Well, okay. Whatever you got going, I hope it's good. Oh, it is. It's real good. Well, I need the gum for the shark, but he he's dead. Once we beat this, he is dead. Obviously. No, I need this way. There you go. We did it! It's fixed! And it'll stay on there, right? We don't have to use any glue or anything. Careful there. Don't ever mention G-L-U-E around old Elmer. Spoops him something awful. Elmer Glue? What's he got against Glue? Obviously taking that. Mr. Tippett, do you think we could have this old mailbox door now that you're not using it anymore? Sure. Take it and leave me to hermit in peace. Thank you. You're welcome. Say it. I guess, I guess he wasn't, you know, that polite. Ooh. Oh boy! A real ten gallon hat! Wait. Thief! Gosh, I'm sorry. I didn't know there was anyone under there. You could have knocked! On a hat? <gasps> oh my god, can I knock? Excuse me, uh, Mr. Shrimp's the name. Used to be Sheriff Shrimp, but now I guess it's just plain shrimp. <laughs> 
Ouch! And what happened to the sheriff part? They took my silver star! You can't be a sheriff without a silver star. Folks won't respect you. Maybe we could help you get your star back. Yeah! I'll tell you what, this county would owe you a great service if you did. I thought you were on vacation. Long tongue. Wanted. Long tongue. Clipper by the sheriff and the county for the discourteous offense of tumbleweed. Shaken. Tumbleweed. Shaken. Oh my god. Some of this shit, I swear to god. Um, can we go that way? No? Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's go. You almost missed it. We made it. I knew we could do it. Get that. Look, Freddy, a purple sea urchin. We're rich. It's a crank handle. Like you said last What's time. What's it doing here all by itself? Shouldn't it be attached to something? <laughs> yeah, I doubt it belongs in this cave. It I does. I wonder how it got in here anyway. Good question. That was a very good question. Maybe the jellyfish. No, it's not gonna touch me? Okay. So we can't go that way? Okay. That's weird. Um, yeah, that goes obviously. Huh? Wow! That's amazing! You should see my brother! Okay, we're not going that way. Um, I need one more sea urchin. This way. I knew that handle belonged somewhere. Touch it. <laughs> Other way. Here, let me help. <laughs> we did it, Luther. It's not, Luther. You are. Oh, that's better. Luther is something else. Oh, I was- Hey, it? look! Mm -hmm. This place is filled with water now! Is it what happened? Are, are we- Ugh. <gasps> Give me that. Oh, boy! I see another purple sea urchin! It's Pepper. Really? whole bunch of pepper. <gasps> ooh, 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 ooh. Which one? It... So this is what we need to look like rest. Why is there only an SMG? Look at this cute spice container. This could come in handy. M. Okay. Um, oh, oh, 
Ooh, ooh, ooh. Give me that. What's that one? It's lemongrass. Is that anything like lemonade? That's disgusting. It's a little more sour than lemonade is. Boy, you're not kidding. I kind of like it, though. Uh, what's this one? <laughs> oh, oh, no! I, I pushed the red one. Pepper. No, no, no. Chili pepper. Something. It's cayenne. Cayenne? Um, cayenne is kind of hot. Drink in the water. Drink it in the water. It feels like my tongue's on fire. Is it? I don't know. It... All right. What about cake? Ooh. Will you Ooh. eat cake? Here, try it. Eat it. What? But it's chocolate. No, not the cake. Gotta love those pigs. So sexy. I'll have to go back and do it. That's not gonna do me any good. Here, try some pepper. Here, here's some pepper. That was you, Luther. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. What? I need K. I really only need one letter. Touch it? Okay, we're good. <gasps> A harmonica! Is it broken? I think maybe you just need some lessons. Hmm. This is harder than it looks. Nope. Nope. Yeah, that's the new word. Nope. I just need his star now. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Here, take that. Yep, yep, take that. Yep, we're good. Bye. Um, go this way. Hey, we have your harmonica. Here, would you like this harmonica? Would I? Oh, boy! This is great! Oh, here, have this lovely bow tie in exchange with my compliments. Thanks. That was a very nice of you. Thank you so much. Now, I can play the blues again. That is fantastic. Ooh, don't skip this part. All right, you hog fish, pay attention. I've gone to a 
lot of trouble and expense to hire these sheep heads to jump over this fence for you. So count them and go to sleep. Please. Please just go to sleep. Please. His little eye twitch wasn't doing it. Bless him, Jean. Yeah. Until <laughs> 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 he swallows it and chokes. That ought to keep that shark busy for a while. Yeah, actually, he looks very happy. Yes, he does. Bye. Ooh, 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 what is this? Can we take one of these starfish with us? Sure. So it all was down here? God needs the star. You were dead. Um, here you are. Here, I think this is yours. That's not my star. The sheriff always wears a silver star. Are you fucking kidding me? No, wrong way. Obviously, no, 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 that way. Obviously, Aiden. Obviously. <sighs> My goodness. My back is killing me and I need to go to bed. I'm gonna go, go yard sailing because I am a loser. Yeah, that's a appropriate term. Here you are. There you go. Here, I believe this is yours. Oh, howdy doody. My starfish! Yahoo! I can't thank you all enough! Anything you need, you just ask. How about that nifty ten gallon hat? Sure! I don't want to be needing that old thing anymore! Now, if you'll excuse me, there are laws to be enforced. Rustlers to be found! Sheriff Shrimp is back in town! But we know where the rustlers are! Are you there? That's a loading zone. Looks like it's still up to us to catch those rustlers and rescue the hogfish. Let's ride! Yeah! Oh boy, a ten gallon hat! This is great! How do I look? Like you need a smaller hat. <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Nope. Angle Goby, I'm at my wit's end. These hogfish are driving me crazy. They won't eat or sleep. And they're so noisy. Where'd they get the accordion? Uh, I don't know. Did you try telling them that story about your trip to Akron? That always puts me to sleep. Oh, thanks a lot. I'm going to have to call Mr. Big again. Oh. I don't even want to know who Mr. Big is. Okay. Um, I need you to do this. That's not gonna. Yes, it will. Here, can you make us a belt buckle out of this? <gasps> Shh! 
Sure. Just bring me a letter to put on it, and I'll get to work. Okay. Here, this is for the belt buckle. <gasps> okay, stand back. My best work! All that's missing is a bell. Here you go. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Mr. Torso. Please, call me Nelson. You just blew that. All I ever wanted was to be a hogfish rancher. I had no idea it would be so much work. Maybe there are some tricks to it that we don't know about. Yeah? Well, I'm going back in. Don't let any non-rustlers inside, okay? Radio. Oh, I'm coming back, bitch. Oh, I'm coming back. Let's go over here. I need orange. From spit. Ugh. <gasps> Miss Stella sure is pretty. Yes, yeah, she is. There we are. This is disgusting. Fellow wrestler. And Odie. I reckon Mr. Big must have sent you to help us out with the hogfish, right? Um. Poor Maury. He's having a terrible time with the hogfish. Well, go on in. He'll be glad to see you. Thank you. Do you think the hogfish are? Well, I think I hear squealing coming from... Mm. Ah! Hey! You two aren't rustlers! What are you doing here? Um, we were just leaving. You're not going anywhere! Mr. Big will know what to do with you! Oh no. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. What do we do now? Oh, it didn't even budge. Nope, this door is definitely locked. Um, 
Hey, it looks like there might be a way out under all these cannonballs. Uh. These are heavy. And you left it like a pro. Uh. There, that does it. Let's go. are the missing hogfish, all right. We're not missing. We know just where we are. <laughs> Look at that one. <laughs> this little piggy went to market. This little piggy stayed home. Oh, no. Not again. Maybe we can get the hogfish out through this hole. The hogfish won't fit through there, but it looks like you and I can. I guess we'll have to work out another way to get those hogfish out. They'll need a bigger opening. That anchor looks really heavy. I'll bet that weighs six tons. What does that mean? That means it's really heavy. Oh. I wonder what this does. No! Okay. This will never reach the bars while the anchor is down. Yeah, got that right. This is a nice dirt. Grab it. The chain won't quite reach the bars. Really, you... Maybe we can make it longer. Go this way. <gasps> what is this? I think I see something behind this thing. You're right. I can't see it very well. The rudder's in the way. I think we have to move the this rudder if we're going to get that thing out of there. It's a hook. Obviously. Is it a hook? You tell me. It's yellow and hooky-like. Turn this. Hi to starboard, Ensign! Did you hear something? Like a creaking noise? I think... Oh, shoot, they probably said something. Okay. Put the hooky hook on that. I bet if we attach this hook to the chain, it'll reach those bars. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Arrgh. That fits just, ooh, ooh, fits like a charm. Let's do this. Let's do this. This should free those hogfish. Luther, prepare to drop anchor. Ready, ready. Fire away. <laughs> what? No! Come back! Please come back! We're going home. The food's terrible here. Oh, what do we do now, Maury? I think you should give yourselves up. You're under arrest in the name of the law. Law? What law? Yeah, I don't see any law. Then I suggest you turn around. Real slow like. It's Sheriff Oh, shit! Yeah, and just about everybody in town, it looks like. Youngsters, that was mighty fine work apprehending these two. I'll be taking them off to jail now. You boys ought to be ashamed of yourselves. Hold on, Sheriff. There's one more person involved with the rustling. Octopus. Yeah, that's right. Octopus. Stop talking to somebody called Mr. Big. 
never saw his face, but he was in charge. He planned the rustling and everything. Is that so? Well, what if it is? We'll never reveal the identity of Mr. Big. Yeah, you'll never catch him. Actually, I know who Mr. Big is. He's right here in the room. <laughs> When the wrestlers caught Luther and me, they called Mr. Big to come and decide what to do with us. I suspect he was already here when you all arrived and just slipped in with the posse. Well, which one is it then? Phil, when we were at the soda room and we found the note telling the wrestlers to meet here, you made a phone call to someone. You were talking about the note. Well, I... And when we got here and found the hogfish, I noticed this. What's that? It's sheep music, Sheriff. The sheep music to this little piggy, to be exact. No need to go on. It's my music. Moray was having trouble getting the hogfish to sleep. So I suggested he try singing this little piggy to them. That lot of good that did. Phil, does that mean that you're... you're... I'm Mr. Big. Yes. <laughs> I, I never meant to hurt anybody, you understand. It's just that I've got 17 children. And I don't make that much as a piano player. I thought Hogfish Ranching might bring in a little extra cash. Well, that's no excuse. You all ought to be ashamed. You just shouldn't take things that don't belong to you. It hurts other people, and it's just plain wrong. Yes. You're right. We're sorry. We didn't want to be rustlers. All we ever really wanted was to be hogfish ranchers, but we don't know how. Ranchers, you say? You know, I do still need some help out at my place. I'm glad that's worked out so well for everyone. Freddy, Luther, I can't thank you enough for all you've done here. The hogfish are home safe. And the rustlers is brought to justice. Yeehaw! How's their immunity service working out? That's community service, son. Oh, yeah. How's that going? I think they're coming along quite well. It's hard work, but when I'm done with them, they'll be real hogfish ranchers. Can we learn to be hogfish ranchers, too? Of course. Here, I've got something for you. Ten gallon oh, hat! Shout. Yours is a five gallon, so it'll fit just right. Oh, boy! Now, come on, you two. I'll show you how to tie a lasso. Oh, give me a home where the buffalo roam, oh where the deer mm -hmm. and the antelope mm -hmm. play. <gasps> oh, my God. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Thanks for watching uh, Freddy Fish for... And I'll see you on the next one, or whatever else ones I can find. <laughs> yeah, I have a few. But thanks for watching.